I'm going to take a look on conversion of fraction in other basins to base 10. Conversion of fraction in other basins to base 10 is something as conversion of number to base 10. Uh, for example, we are given a question here. They ask us to express the following fractions as denary. That is, denary is something as base 10. Now, number one question asks us express 0 0.101012. That is in base 2. 0 0.1010 base 2 to denary. That is to uh, express it to base 10. In this case, looking at it, we have a integral part and the decimal part. In numbering of the integ integral part, we start here, as I said earlier, here from zero. But from the decimal part, we start from minus one, minus two, minus three, and then minus four. Now, we have, because that this number is in base two, we start from zero times two because this zero is less to power zero that our, our two will be what? less to power zero plus one times two because of this number is less to power minus one here will be what? minus one plus plus Zero times two. Hope we all understand why we are tensing by two because we are converting to the we are because that the number is in base two. That's why we are uh, multiplying by two. Okay, this number zero zero times two raised power minus two plus one times two raised to power minus 3 plus 0 times 2 raised to the power minus 4 plus 1 times 2 raised to the power minus 5. Here is minus 5. Okay, now we have 0 times 2 raised to the power 0 plus here you have one times two by one one times two by one is something as one times one over two plus zero times here we have here we have two by two which is something as one over two less to power two plus here we have 1 times 2 bar bar 3, which is something as 1 over 2 raised to power 3 plus 0 times 2 bar 4, which is something as 1 over 2 raised to power 4 plus 1 times 2 bar 5, which is something as 1 over 2 raised to power 5. Okay, now we have, here we have this one, 0 times 2 raised to power 0. We know that any number raised to power 0 is what? 1. That means you have 0 times what? 1 here, plus, plus, 1 times what? Half, plus, 0 times 1. 2 raised to the power 2 is something as what? 4. 1 over 4 plus 1 over 2 raised to the power 3 is something as 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 2, which is what? Into 3 phrases, which is what? 8. That is here is 8 plus 0 times 1 over 2 into 4. 2 times 2, 4. 4 times 2, 8. 8 times 2 is 16. 16 
plus one times one over two raised to the power of five, so that's like what? Thirty two. Okay, in this case we have zero times this, so I'm to get this one is zero plus this one is half plus this one zero times this, so I'm to get here is as long zero. Zero plus plus one times eight, which is one over eight plus here has gone, which is what zero. That is zero times one over six is zero plus what one times is what one over thirty two. Okay, now we have 1 over 2 plus 1 over 8 plus 1 over 32. Now we find the, we find the LCM. Our LCM is what? We have 32. 2 divide this, we have... 16 plus the 2 divided by 8. We have the 2 divided by 8. 8 times 20. 20. The 2 divided by 8. We have 4. And this one, we have 1. So we have 21 over 9. So, second question. Second question. Ask also. In second question. Second question. They ask also. Convert. That 4.23 that is in base 5 to denali, which is in base 10. The answer to convert to base 10. So, as I said earlier, the integral part is start from the right hand number 0, 1. From the decimal part, you have what? Minus 1 and the minus 2. Because of this number is what? In base 5, that, that is, you have this one instead. We have 3 times 5 raised to the power 1 plus 4 times 5 raised to the power 0 plus here 2 times 5 raised to the power minus 1 plus 3 times 5 raised to the power minus 2. Okay, here we have 5 raised to the power 1 is 20 as 5. That means we have 3 times 5 here is what? 15. Plus, plus here we have 4 times 5 raised to the power 0. And here 5 raised to the power 0. Anything raised to the power 0 is 1. We have 4 times 1. We have 1, 4 here. Plus, here is what? 2 times. 5 raised to the power minus 1. 2 times 5 raised to the power. 5 by 1 is something as 1 over 5. That means we have 2 times 2 times 1 over 5. Plus, here we have 3 times 5 by 2. 5 by 2, which is sent as 1 over 5 raised to the power 2. 3 times 1 over 5 raised to the power 2. So in this case, now we have here, we have 15 plus 4 plus 2 times 1 over 5 is sent as 2 over 5 plus 4. 3 times 1 over 5 raised to the power 2 is sent as 4. 3 over 5 raised to the power 2. 
Okay, now here we have okay, 15 plus 4, we have 19 plus 2 over 5 plus 35 raised to the power 2 is sent in as 25. Okay, here now we have 19 plus the LCM of 5 and 25 is what? 25. That means you have 25. 5 divided this, you have 5. 10 plus 9. 25 divided 25, you have 1. Multiply by 3, we have 3. Now we have here yeah, 13 over 25. Now we have, our answer is what? 19 year old number, 13 over 25. Which means that 34.23 base 5 is equal to 19 year old number, 13 over 25 base 10. Admission. 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 Dear ladies and gentlemen, I bring good news. Admission into the diocese on the Niger School of Pharmacy Technician EENU Mission Hospital is on. The School of Pharmacy Technician PhD, is an accredited tertiary institution that offers students a diploma degree to work in hospitals and pharmaceutical companies in order to promote safe and effective use of medicines at grassroots level. Graduates of Pharmacy Technician School EENU who wish to study pharmacy in the university can obtain direct entry into any university of their choice. The school has a well-equipped laboratory, comfortable hostel, and a healthy refectory. The requirements for admission are credit in English, mathematics, biology, chemistry and physics. In GCE, WAEC, NECO. NABTEB are not more than two sittings. The School of Pharmacy Technician PhD, is located at EENU Mission Hospital, Agidi, Anambra State. For more information, call 0803-708-1512-0813-868-2003-0803-267-5322. Diocese on the Niger School of Pharmacy Technician. A tradition of excellence.